Hey man, well, we were talking about you learning how to use a metronome, uh, which is something that you need to do because otherwise I'm going to be really angry. <laughs> Uh, joking aside, uh, this is a very important thing and it involves learning a bit or two about rhythmic subdivisions. Um, usually you're going to be dealing with, so, or the first of your uh, encounters with a metronome will be dealing with the 4x4 uh, four four time signature. That means that you have four quarter notes. You know, uh, A note can be a whole note and you, have a, you can have a whole note throughout the length of a bar. You can have two half notes instead of having one whole note. You can have four quarter notes instead of having two half notes. You can have uh, eight, uh, okay, eight, eight notes instead of four quarter notes. And you can have 16 sixteenth notes instead of eight eighth notes. You understand? So, one can be two, two can be four, four can be eight, and eight can be sixteen. I don't have sixteen fingers, unfortunately. Eh? <laughs> um, once you realize this, um, and you get acquainted with the idea, I'm going to ask you to try the following exercise. Get a metronome and set it up at 60 beats per minute, so 60 BPM at four, uh, on a 4x4 four four time signature. Please try and play, use the same note. So you have the, let's say, A note. Okay? And I'm going to ask you to play all these rhythmic subdivisions um, as follows, and I'm going to show you here so that you may get acquainted with the idea and then I'm going to give you one of Ben lessons which deals with this exact same thing and you're going to learn how to use the metronome and the rhythmic subdivisions. Okay? So, my metronome, as you can see, is at 60 beats per minute. Ah, uh, no, like this. Okay, 60 beats per minute and 4x4 four four time signature, right? One, two, three, four. Ah, I get myself carried away. Anyway, uh, I'm going to uh, try it again, but first let me tell you what I'm going to do. First, I'm going to play one bar uh, consisting of a whole note. Then the next bar, two half notes, then four quarter notes, then eight eighth notes, and then sixteen sixteenth notes. Okay? Let's go. Two, three, four. to the 16th notes. Yeah, so I did a 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4, wow. so 4 notes on each beat. Now I'm going to play the 8 notes so that you can uh, listen to those two. So you have 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2, 1, 2. 8 notes in the whole bar and 2 notes on each quarter on each beat of the bar. Okay, so you have 4 beats, 2 notes on each beat that gives you 8 notes, right? 2, 3, Let's count. See? Eight equal notes. The whole thing here is to be consistent and keep the notes equal. Okay? So I'm going to ask you to try to do this exercise. So one bar consisting in one, uh, of one whole note, then the next bar having two half notes, then the next bar having four quarter notes, the next bar having eight eight notes, and then the next bar having 16, 16 notes. So you see I have 16 fingers after all. If you have any questions, you know where to find me. Cheers, man.